Welcome to this Tutor to You topic video that looks at why Lagos is so important. This is part of paper 2, Unit A, Urban Issues and Challenges. Lagos is located in the southwest of Nigeria on the coast of the Gulf of Guinea. It is about 500 kilometres southwest from the capital city of Abuja and about 50 kilometres from the border of the neighbouring country of Benin. Estimates of Lagos's population vary widely. Many sources quote a figure of 17.1 million, however other sources state that it could be closer to 21 million. It is the third largest African city after Cairo in Egypt and Kinshasa in the Democratic Republic of the Congo, and it is one of the fastest growing cities in Africa, with around 1.1 million people added each year. Lagos is the former capital of Nigeria. In 1906, it was made the capital of southern Nigeria, and when the separate states of southern and northern Nigeria merged into a single state in 1914, Lagos became the capital city of that. It remained the capital city after independence from British rule in 1960 until 1991, when it was then replaced by Abuja, which was seen as a better choice than Lagos for a number of reasons. The Nigerian government decided to move away from Lagos as they felt that the coastal location favoured those living in the south much more than the rest of the country. Lagos had also become increasingly congested and it lacked space for further development, which meant that future growth of the capital city was limited. However, despite not being the capital city anymore, Lagos is still the most important city in Nigeria and it is an important global city. Let's have a look at the things that make Lagos nationally important. It is the largest city in Nigeria and is home to around 10% of the population. The city covers less than 0.5% of Nigeria's landmass and it is the smallest state in the country. However, its history of economic growth and transformation makes it the most important city in the country and it now generates the highest internal revenue of all the states. Lagos actually generates about 30% of Nigeria's GDP and most commercial and financial businesses are carried out in the central business district situated on the island. In addition, 60% of Nigeria's industrial and economic activities are based in the city and most large Nigerian companies have their headquarters in Lagos. Most Nigerian manufacturing is also located in Lagos and the city is a major financial and banking centre home to the headquarters of the largest four banks in West and Central Africa. The port of Lagos which is pictured on the screen is the leading port in Nigeria and it is one of Africa's largest and busiest ports. Additionally, Lagos has a large concentration of universities, including some of the oldest and most prestigious in the country. And in fact, there are 136 universities in Lagos State. And finally, Lagos is a cultural hub of Nigeria. It is home to the Nollywood film industry, but also to countless galleries, museums and performance spaces, particularly those that reflect Yoruba culture. But Lagos is also very important globally. It is one of the fastest growing cities in the world, increasing by about 1.1 million people annually. And it is the third largest city after Cairo in Egypt and Kinshasa in the Democratic Republic of the Congo. Lagos is a mega city and a global city in terms of its global importance, but also down to the fact that its foreign born population is rising rapidly. As a city, Lagos is actually one of the largest economies in Africa, larger than the economy of most countries on the continent. Its GDP, which is gross domestic product, is expected to be $250 billion by the end of 2025. It's also the major information and telecommunications hub of West Africa. And the headquarters of many global companies are based in Lagos, which has opened up thousands of job opportunities in the complex mix of businesses and professional services needed to support them. The Lecky oil refinery, which you can see on the screen, is the seven largest oil refinery in the world. And it processes over 650,000 barrels of oil per day. Lagos is becoming an attractive city to overseas investors. New service industries from around the globe are choosing to locate the CBD. An example of this is Echo Atlantic, which is a joint project between the Nigerian government and private investors, many of whom are foreign. This project is covered in detail in another video. 
Related to this is the fact that Lagos is home to more tech hubs than any other city in Africa, including a number of startups, and it is often referred to as Africa's Silicon Valley. In addition, Lagos's Matala Mohammed International Airport is the busiest airport in Nigeria for both domestic and international flights with hundreds of non-stop destinations around the world. It handles around 7 million passengers each year, around half of the total air passengers in Nigeria, with around 3 million of these flying internationally and it is also the main arrival point for 80% of flights into West Africa. Finally, Lagos is the centre of the West African film, music and TV industries and central to this is the Nollywood film industry, which is ranked in second place behind Bollywood in Mumbai in India and just ahead of the more famous Hollywood. That concludes this Tutor to You topic video focusing on the importance of Lagos. Thank you for watching.